Hello everyone, I hope everybody's well, all your birds are well, and you're starting into breeding season now wherever you are in the world. Just another quick little video update for myself, breeding season still going really well here. Goldians are breeding, star finches are breeding, and this is just a quick update on the latest four fledglings that I've been blessed with if I'm honest. Uh, as you can see at the bottom, bottom right hand corner of the screen, that's mum and dad. The four up on the perch are the fledglings that came out of the nest yesterday. Four very big, strong, healthy and active as you'll see as this video goes on. Blue Goldians. Now, I originally paired this pair of birds together, hoping to create some split blues for the future breeding program. Uh, but as you can see, mum has surprised me in the fact that she, she herself is actually a split blue Goldian greenback as you can see from the four chicks that she's hatched for me and successfully got out of the nest um, people who follow me on Instagram might recognize the hen this hen originally I actually got from a sweet little old lady who's, who unfortunately her husband passed away um, and she could no longer take care of the birds so I took three or four for her to help her out to ease the load. When I originally got this hen, the baby's just jumping on the back there. Uh, when I originally got this hen, she was as bald as bald Goldians you'll ever see. Um, no, no fault of the little old ladies. Um, sometimes it can be genetic, sometimes it's dietary. Um, but as you can see now, she's yeah in very good condition. She's got her head feathers back. She's put some good weight on. Uh, hence I decided to put her with this quite big blue male Gordian that I've got. Um, they both seem to like each other as soon as they met. They were nest building within 10 or 15 minutes of being together. Uh, and as you can see they've been very successful. These four blue Gordian chicks are actually quite big as you can see with them next to their dad. Uh, they've come out the nest very big for chicks really from what I've seen in the past um, but yeah I'm over the moon with it when, when you put a blue bird with a green bird you're not always going to get every single chick being blue um, sometimes out of a nest of four you, you may be lucky to get one maybe two when I realised on the first nest check that these were all four all four of these were blue. Um, yeah, to say I feel blessed and happy is a bit of an understatement. Uh, yeah, they, these will probably be with mom and dad now for the next seven to ten days until they wean. Although, believe it or not, daddy's already nest building again. Uh, mom already had two eggs in the nest before these chicks had even fledged. And they are new eggs because I always remove the infertile eggs. Um, to make sure there's no decaying or broken eggs in there when the chicks are growing up before they fledge. But yeah, I just wanted to show you these beautiful birds. If you have any questions on breeding these birds, on dietary requirements, I don't really like going into medical conditions because, quite frankly, I'm not a vet. Um, I, I can advise on some certain medicines which are good, as precautionary medicines, as pre-breeding medicines that I, I treat my birds for or with, um, but as actually conditions and ill birds, all I can strongly say is get them to a vet, an avian vet, because they are the best people to actually help you in that scenario. Um, thank you for watching this video again. Um, please subscribe to this channel to follow my breeding season as I say the star finches are still breeding at the moment I'll add a couple of photos at the end of this video to show you the condition I picked mom up in and the condition that she's obviously in now um, and you can also follow me on Instagram which has changed to Goldian underscore UK thanks for watching again hope to speak to you soon feel free to message and comment and I'll reply as soon as possible. Thank you.